The triangle inequality. Triangle inequality is talking about the sides of a triangle. If I take A, AB, the side up here, plus side BC, so if I take this side AB plus this side BC, it will be larger than AC, the side at the bottom. What that says is the sum of the lengths of any two sides of a triangle is always greater than the length of the third side. If I add any two sides together, I have to be bigger than the third side. If we look at a demonstration of this, I have this triangle on the screen, ABC. The side lengths are there. I'm going to choose BC and CA. BC is the blue one. CA is the red one. Notice how they are 10.7 centimeters long. What I want to know is are BC and CA longer than the green segment no matter what I do. If I get them really big, obviously that's not going to prove anything. They're just getting very long. If I get them really close to the green, notice I'm only 0.02 centimeters away, but the purple, which is the combination of the two, is longer. As I get closer, it's really close, and finally I get it to be equal when the segments are on top of each other, which would no longer make a triangle. If I move it really close to one end, definitely bigger. And if I move it to the other end, also definitely bigger. The triangle inequality theorem tells us that any two sides of a triangle are always bigger than the third side. Question, can these side lengths make a triangle? The way we check that is, we test to see if any two sides would be shorter than the third. 20 plus 35. Is that bigger than 15? Well, 55 is definitely bigger than 15. Our first check works. We got to try another pair of sides. 15 plus 35. Is that bigger than 20? 50 bigger than 20 for sure. We have one comparison left. 15 plus 20, is that bigger than 35? 35. Bigger than 35? No. So can these side lengths make a triangle? No. The reason is it failed at the end. If at any time it fails, it can no longer make a triangle. You try it with this one. Hopefully you pause the tape to check. We go through the check again. 5 plus 10 greater than 7. 15 greater than 7. That works. 5 plus 7 greater than 10. 12 greater than 10. That works. And lastly, 7 plus 10 greater than 5, 17 greater than 5. So the answer here is yes, it does make a triangle. The last question here is find the range of values of the third side of a triangle with two sides 11 and 6 centimeters. We have a triangle that is 6 centimeters by 11 centimeters. We want to know what are the possibilities for that third side. This is actually a fairly simple question. We know that the first two sides always have to be bigger than the third side. So we'll just call it C. 17 has to be bigger than C. We know that C cannot be bigger than 17. The other thing we need to think about is how small can it be? Well, it actually can't be all the way down to 1 because 1 plus 6 would not be bigger than 11. We know that 11 is going to be the longest side 
How we calculate then is we take 6 plus our unknown side, and that has to be bigger than 11. Solving this inequality, we get C is greater than 5. We are going to write this as a compound inequality. That means C goes in the middle, and we know that C has to be bigger than 5 and whoops, I wrote my inequality backwards, has to be bigger than 5 and smaller than 17. We've now written it as a range. C, our third side, has to be bigger than 5 but smaller than 17. That's the end of today's lesson. Make sure you bring back any questions to class and clarify them before moving on.